Hey guys, so I'm gonna actually um give you a tech haul. And um this is what I got at Fleet Farm, Mills Fleet Farm, and I love Fleet Farm. Sorry about this bed. Yeah, it's a bed, I guess. And so yeah, let's get started. Okay, first of all I went to Fleet Farm and I bought a bunch of stuff for my donkey. Because my uncle Kevin up north, he raises beef cows, and um, he needed something to chase the wolves away because there's wolves up there now. So he got uh, me a donkey, and the cows a donkey, I guess. And so we decided, to, me and my mom decided to spoil it by going to Fleet Farm and spoiling it, which we haven't even seen yet. And his name is Jimmy. He's a um yearling right now he's he just got weaned and so yeah i'm gonna start out with the more tack stuff so what i got was this um lunge rope and it's really cool colors it has like green here i'll show you i'll focus it it has green i don't know if you can see it but it's purple yellow blue and red and i think it's really cool yeah it's really big like Really big. Here, I'll put it against my wall. It's like really long too. No, oh, it just fell. Okay. Anyway, that's that. To the side. And then I also got the donkey. Oh, I just showed you a bit of it. But I also got the donkey. This amazing halter. Focus. There you go. This amazing blue halter because it is a boy. Like I said, his name is Jimmy. And that is, it's a little big for him, I think, even though I have not seen him. And I've never seen a donkey in my life. So, well, I have, but he wasn't mine. And I just think this halter was so adorable. So I had to get it for him. Because he's going to be my baby. And it says on the, it, this is what it was, but it's a weanling pony one. And this tag ripped in the bag. So, yeah. So, yeah, those are the two things. Then I also got, well, my mom, actually, I'll leave these last, but grooming supplies. I got this mane and tail brush um, with a little hook pick at the end, which probably does not hook that well. Otherwise, it's just something you can hold. I don't think it's really a hook pick because it doesn't have sharp. Not that sharp, really. But, yeah, that's that, and it's metal. Sounds. It doesn't sound metal, but it actually is. Metal. Metal. So yeah, that's that. Then I also got, my mom decided to get, um, this curry comb. That's a part of it. And it, that's the curry part. Feel it. Yeah, I know, it feels so good. It's sparkly, even though it's a boy donkey. We still are going to spoil it with a really awesome curry comb. And, I, and my mom decided to get this one, and I decided to get something else. And I'm going to put you down for a second. Sorry. I'm just going to put it down for you. Okay, as you can see, I've been kind of wearing it a little bit, and I really like it because you can kind of, like, curve your hand a little bit. <laughs> that sounds funny. Okay, but you can see, like, a bump because my palm, this part right here, my palm. Okay, anyway, this is the back, and it's like a rubby part, like a weird kind of part. But anyway, it's super cool, and that was my mom's decision. I really want to get a blue one, like above that color. But my mom said no, so, yeah. And this was my decision. Voila! This is a zebra brush. My brother, Gage, hated it so much. He thought that that'd be a worse color for the boy donkey. It's a boy donkey. I don't care. And my brother said, that's so stupid. But I said, that's so cute. And I loved it because it has zebra. I love zebras. Zebra. Zebra. And it has blue on it. So I said, it's a little bit manly. So. Sorry about the brightness on my bed. It's kind of weird. There, that's the color of my bed. There's my bed. I like that one. And that one, and I like the I hold that and that one. So that's basically all of them. And uh, okay, anyway, back to the barn tour. And it says here. Let me show you. 
It says Tail Tamer products. So yeah, I thought, this is not a tail brush. It's a flick brush. Oh, by the way, this is a curry gum. So yeah, that was my decision. I love it because it's a zebra. Okay. Then my mom decided to get the donkey horse treats. And these, I don't know. Tell me if these are good treats for horses or donkeys. Either one because horses are just like donkeys actually. But um, that's a really pretty horse on there. Anyway. It says nutritious. I don't know how to. Ah, I, just, I get stuck on that word. But treats for horses, great for training. And we are going to train the donkey, me and my mom. They're bite size nuggets, I guess. It says horses can't resist the taste. So, sorry about that. This is the back. And if you want to read that, that'd be really hard to read. But you could, like, stop here. And you can read that. And I just thought this would be great because my mom actually did want to get kind. Which is, here's all the kinds. It's just carrot and spice, butterscotch, or peppermint. My mom really thought peppermint would be good for the horse. But I said, I think that the donkey love apples. So, yeah, let me just give you an overview of everything I got. I just showed show the zebra side. And that's everything I got. Mm. Yeah, so. That's everything. So thanks for watching, guys. Um, hope you liked it. Sorry it was very short. Um, but, yeah. I kind of do this on my tablet, so it's kind of shaky like that. Not sad. But, anyway, bye, guys. Thanks for watching.